Good evening, y'all, and welcome to another video of mine. Today I'm gonna be doing a comparison <clears throat> of this uh, this new ultra budget smartphone, which apparently is by Blue. I remember I found this at the dollar store, like thirty dollars. You know, brand new inside box never been used and I went ahead and gave it a head start on Geekbench as you can see it's it's called Blue it's, brand name is called Blue Android 11 I went ahead and gave that a head start. Anyway, the, this uh, this uh, new phone never been used. It came out of the box, got for ultra cheap at the dollar store, like thirty dollars. But it is brand new. You know, made this year in 2022. And today, and today we're going to be comparing this against against this phone, which the which the Samsung Galaxy S S8 Active. Now, obviously, this is a much older front phone. It's from it's from 2017. Yeah, this. This is from 2022. This one's from 2017. Now, obviously, this is a much older phone. However, this is a flagship, and this one's an ultra budget phone. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and run the benchmark on here as well. See, I already got it open. Now, apparently, apparently, one one thing off the bat is. This apparently has a slightly newer version of Android. This has Android 11. And this has Android 9. I went ahead and gave this a head start because I already figured this is going to be slow. But anyway, I'll go ahead and, I'll go ahead and run this benchmark as well. And here shortly we'll be comparing the scores. <coughs> See apparently this apparently this is a blue model B131DL. And this one's a Samsung Galaxy S8 active. So this, this is going to be much faster, despite it being much older. Despite it being much older, this is going to be much faster, I can tell. And we will see here in a little bit by the scores. As you can tell, they're both running the same Geekbench app, Geekbench 5. So you remember I gave this one a few minutes head start. Probably to be exact, maybe about five minutes head start on this. Cause you can see I already started the geek bench on this before the video.
maybe I'll see if this this can still finish first anyway. Okay, this one's at 51, this one's at 86. We'll see the scores here in a little bit. PDF rendering. Oh, this SA deck is getting caught, caught right on up. This one's still at 90. This one's already at 81. So you remember for this video you already had this like at 40 some, 50 some percent. And this one I didn't start yet. Okay. Looks like this did finish first, but remember I did give it a head start. And this one's got a single core of score of 85 and a multi-core score of 390. Four cores, I guess three gigs of RAM. And we'll see the S8 Active's scores here in a little bit right here. And we got it. The S8 active scores a single core score of 360 and a multi score four score multi core score of 1442. So yeah, even though it's much older, the S8 the S8 does be this. New new budget phone in any way, in every way. Cause I imagine putting it in writing. So you can see the scores there, and obviously. Obviously this one's from 2022. That'd be this phone here. And this phone here is from 
2017. So there, we, there you go, just a comparison. So yeah, it looks like in this experiment, it looks like the old, looks like the older flagship. You know, completely won this this comparison against the new budget phone. Well, thank. Thanks for watching and have a good day.